Hey everybody, today we're going to talk about primers. We're going to talk about what primers are, when to use them, and everything you need to know about them. I'm Dan Frost from HGF Painting, the fine art of painting, and this is Talk Shop with Frost. So what is a primer? A primer basically is that first base coat you want to use on any substrate that you're painting. Whether it's bare wood, metal, uh, surfaces that you've prepped, uh, you can prime over uh, a not a really sound paint job. And why is that important? Well you want, a, a primer is a, a first coat that really adheres to that substrate. So it provides a really good base for the next coat of paint. Um, they come in three different kinds. There's a water base, there's oil base, and there's shellac base. First we have the latex primers. Uh, and the nice thing about latex primers are they're easy to clean up. They're, they don't have a real strong smell. Uh, they're usually low in VOCs, which is the uh, volatile organic compound, which most latex um, products are. And um, they are very flexible, so it prevents cracking. And the, the best latex primer out there in the market is this Fine Paints of Europe Uni Primer. Uh, you can use it interior and exterior. It's a great product. Uh, next we have the oil primers. Uh, right here we have a can of Fresh Start Benjamin Moore Oil Primer. Um, the nice thing about the oil primers is they will seal any tanning bleeds, like on red cedar shingles or red cedar clapboards. You have to use an oil-based primer. Uh, the little disadvantage is they do smell and you have to clean them up with mineral spirits. Uh, but they're very effective with um, sealing uh, any tanning uh, bleed from a product. Finally, we have the shellac based uh, primers. And what they're specifically used for is water stains or smoke stains. Okay? Um, the go to product for that is the bin primer sealer. You clean that up with um, denatured alcohol. Uh, usually you can take a throwaway brush and use it, but two coats of that over knots that bleed through or smoke stains or water stains, perfect product for that bench lac based uh, primer sealer. Okay, so just to recap, when do you want to use a primer? You want to use a primer on bare plaster, okay? And when you do it on bare plaster, you want to use a latex primer. The Fine Paints of Europe Universal Primer is really good. Benjamin Warm makes a fresh dark primer that's really good. Um, California Paints makes a primer that's really good. Um, uh, C2 makes a really good wallboard primer. And Sherman Williams makes a really good wallboard and uh, wall and trim primer that's really good on plaster, new plaster, okay? Latex on new plaster. Bare wood, new trim that's put on your house. You want to use a primer, Universal Fine Paints Universal Primer. There's a uh, product by C2 called the Undercoater. Again, it's latex. Now, the thing about on bare wood is, after you prime it, a lot of times it will raise the grain of the wood. And it'll be a little bit rough. So you want to sand that down with 220 sandpaper, and then prime it again. Two coats of primer, and then you're ready for your finish. Okay. Um, for water stains or smoke stains, you want to use BIN. It's an alcohol-based primer sealer. You want to use that to seal the water stains or seal the smoke stains, okay? It has real high odor to it. They do have some products. Kills makes a product, product that's odorless, if you'd like. You have to pay a little bit more money, but it's odorless, okay? Works just as well. And you can use a throwaway brush with this, and you're all set. If you have some clapboards, new clapboards or new shingles on the outside of your house that are cedar, there's a tendency for the tannins to bleed out. That's where you need an oil-based primer. Fresh Start from Benjamin Moore is an oil-based primer for, that, for those um, purposes. Um, so when you can, use the latex. It's easy to clean up. Works really well. If you have specific problems like water stains, smoke stains or tannin bleeds, use an oil-based or an alcohol-based primer. And then you're all set. If you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button at the bottom. This is Dan Frost from 
HDF Painting, the fine art of painting, and this has been Top Shop with Frost.